All right, so here's another uh, Amazon garbage uh, spotlight to light up a room. Uh, per usual, this is Chinese crap. Uh, you're going to see this type everywhere on Amazon. At least five sellers selling this exact same one because it's Chinese garbage. Um, so you're going to have your, it, it lets you do the remote solar. So here's your solar panel. Uh, you can screw in, seal, charge, seal. Um, the cool thing about this is you could put the solar panel outside and have this light a room inside. So this one I think claims it's 3,000 lumens and Amazon has a major issue where they do not regulate the lumens. They do not make you tell the truth. Most of the Chinese garbage like these are going to claim they're over a thousand lumens and they are not. I think this one claims 3,000. So let's see how much of the room it actually lights. Let's turn it on. And that's the brightest. Alright, we're going to do the compare in the middle of this video. This is a Swiss Tech 1200 lumen flashlight. Its settings are 300 lumen and 1200 lumens, eight LEDs. Uh, a lot of the Amazon Chinese crap like to say, oh, we got X amount of LEDs. Usually when something says that, they're a piece of junk, as you see here. All right. So I think this one said it was 3000 lumens, which I know it is not. So I'm going to turn this on to its max setting. Let's turn off all the lights. Get this on its max setting. All right, I think it's on its max setting. We see the room. It's like barely lit. This is so bad. First setting of this flashlight is 300 lumens. If this is not brighter than this, then you should not see a change in this room. Oh my God. Are you kidding me? And this isn't even on its highest setting, so we'll go. Let's turn this back on. So this is 1,200 lumens in this room. What in the hell is this thing doing? That's what 1,200 lumens looks like. I'm lighting up the whole room. What the hell is this thing doing? Put the flashlight back down to 300. That's 300. Look at that. <laughs> okay. That's how you know these things are garbage. This this is basically a, a little tiny spotlight. That is probably like 150 lumens or something worse. Uh, total garbage. It will light out, light up an area for you to walk in, but that's about it. It's only going to light up the area right in front of it. That's it. It's not going to do. It's not going to do the three hundred lumens. This is three hundred lumens, which is a you can you could actually see stuff on the ground. And this is you would be able to see everywhere in front of you. You know, if there's a bear outside or something. All right. But the good thing about it is you can point these in different areas. So it's good enough to light a room so you can see where you're going. And that's about it. But a 3,000 lumen, uh, 3,000 to 2,000 lumen would, would um, light the room up like it was daytime. Where this obviously is not doing that. Let's get the motion sensor going. This is obviously not doing that. You could see we're in the dark. So, um, it works. It's motion sensing. Uh, I believe it has 18650, 18650 batteries in them. Um, you can do these things to mount it. It's these new Chinese fangle stuff. Uh, yeah, you screw this to the wall and then just mount it like that. Instead of having to screw it right into the wall. Um, 
but yeah, this is a lie. It's not the loom as it says it is. But you see, it's you know, oh, or if you hang it up on the, the wall somewhere, it'll light the room up better. Yeah, maybe. Uh, just because this is pointing in so many different directions, and you got your lenses on here, spreading the light. Um, maybe. This would be closer to the thousand lumens than other ones, the other drunk ones. But yeah, uh, you generally get two of these and a remote control with them. Uh, so if you can get it for under 20 or under 30, probably worth it. But again, don't expect it to light the room like it's the daytime. That's that's a lie. That's what 3,000, 2,000, 3,000 lumens would do. That's not what these are. 